What is going on guys? My name is Ted and Ted bring you a flawless 30-0 free-for-all on the map underground with a Moab. So um, I use the PP90 rapid fire cinematic combination, which is actually pretty cool because I'm not using a silencer. Um, you're gonna see a lot of the Moabs on YouTube um, generally are gonna occur with the silencer because not having the enemy know where you are where you're at is a huge advantage. Um, however, the one big downfall to the silencer on submachine guns is that submachine guns have really limited range to start with and when you cut that down even further with the silencer the gun's almost ineffective um, especially the PP90 if you don't already know the PP90 is a six bullet kill at, at long ranges so if you throw a silencer on there it's almost always going to be a six bullet kill and although it's got um, great great um, fire rate you're still not going to be able to get a kill very quickly um, at six bullets until you get the specialist bonus so anyways I'm not talking about too much about the gameplay I wanted to say that I'm going to have an ask me anything kind of a kind of a deal going on on YouTube. So if you want to ask me any questions about you know my YouTube channel, personal life, whatever you want to whatever you want to do, um, post a comment down below and I'm going to answer them. Probably a couple videos from now I'm going to make one where I do I answer all the, all the questions and feedback y'all are going to give me. Um, also, if you want to comment on my channel at all, if you want to tell me you know what I'm doing wrong, what I need to start doing correctly, um, things like that, feel free to do that. <clears throat> I had a comment posted recently, someone was saying, you know, oh, demolition spawn traps are dead, and so your channel's dead. And <laughs> that's not the truth, guys. My channel's going to keep thriving, um, at least it's been doing so recently. Um, demolition spawn traps were just one aspect of my channel. I really tried to diversify. I know that my channel was started on strictly demolition spawn traps, and some of my older subscribers are going to realize that that was all I used to post back in Black Ops. And if you haven't checked this out, I know I've gotten hundreds of substance MW3s release. Probably the, the vast majority of y'all are from MW3s release. Go on my channel and, and um, click back to some of the old videos. I'll leave links down in the description if I remember. Um, I've got some pretty impressive demolition spawn trap guides from Black Ops where I got 230 kills, 240 kills um, in a single game of demolition. Um, I think my highest was 241 kills or 231 kills, one of those two numbers um, on a demolition nuketown spawn trap. And I've even got some montages from back then in, uh, on my spawn trap. I got spawn trap montages. And one of them, at the very end, I posted a clip where I got 30 men in, in, um, in 21 seconds. So it was pretty, with an M60 big ammo. Um, it was awesome. I never let go of the trigger. And then I ended up, like, change weapons to a for the very end. And I ended up getting uh, 30 men in 21 seconds, which is really hard to do. I mean, people really do underestimate a lot of the spawn traps. They, they, pe people do like to complain and say, oh, it's a cheap way to get kills. I'll, I'll give you, it's kind of cheap. But you also have to realize it's really hard to pull off. You can't just go into any lobby and, and get a spawn trap going. Um, it takes a really good team and it takes really bad enemy players. And that's one final topic I'll cover. So I had a couple comments recently um, posting about how the people I play against are generally really bad players. And guys, I, I really don't have any control over that. But if you go into any famous YouTubers' um, higher scoring games, you're going to realize that the majority of the good scores are going to be going to be going against bad players. I mean, it's very difficult to pull off a fantastic game against, you know, MLG opponents. Um, and that's, that's one more thing I'll, I'll comment on is I do read everyone's comments. I know I don't reply to very many comments. I, I should probably start doing that a lot more because I know people like um, feel like they've been heard. And I really do read every single one of the comments. So if you leave a comment, it's going to be heard. Um, whether a re reply or not is, is questionable because a lot of times it's just the same comment over and over again. But I do love all the feedback y'all give me. And once again, just a reminder, I'm going to be doing that question and answer thing. Um, ask me anything, pretty much. So if you want to leave a comment down below with any questions you have for me, I'll make sure to answer those in my next video. Other than that, guys, have a fantastic day. The final score of this gameplay was once again 30. You know, I didn't die the entire gameplay. Went flawless, got my mob right there, and uh, I think I run around trying to pick up my last kill. So if you enjoyed the video, make sure to click that like button. If you're new to my channel, make sure to click the subscribe button. I post high-quality content every single day, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye.